Hello everyone, welcome to the One Class channel. My name is Millen and I am a software engineering student at Carleton University in Ottawa, Canada. Today, I will be going over some commonly asked mathematics questions at both the high school and university or college levels. If you're interested, if you're interested in getting help with some tutoring, or if you're interested in getting some help with your homework, check out the links in the description below. Cool, so I'm gonna switch my screen real fast and we can get right into this mathematic magic. Okay, so the first question that we have on our menu today is asking us if we could possibly um, simplify the expression natural logarithm of 5. Okay, so are we able to simplify this? The short answer is no, but we could also learn quite a lot if we um, try to identify things that we could look for if we um, did want to simplify this. So things to look for. To look for. To simplify. So the things that we want to generally look for for when we are simplifying logarithms logs we want to look for um, coefficients on the logarithms on the logs and when we see a coefficient we want to convert to powers like so. So suppose we have a natural logarithm of x. We want to simplify to make it just ln of x with x to the power of a. Okay, so we want to move those coefficients into the power. But clearly that does not apply here. Well, if we have a coefficient of 1 and well 5 to the power of 1 is 1, so um, not particularly useful for this case. Um, another thing that we want to do is addition um, should be combined addition of logs okay so suppose that we have something like ln of x plus ln of y, we want to rewrite this as ln of x times y. Okay? Now, same thing can be said with uh, division, but division is um, going to be associated with subtraction. Should be combined as well. So if we had a situation like ln of x minus ln of y, instead of multiplying them together in their compressed version, um, you're going to divide them. So it's going to be x uh, divided by y. Okay, so this is how we would typically simplify uh, logarithms, but um, clearly these are none of these are relevant to this particular one that we're given, logarithm 5. There's no coefficient, or the coefficient is 1, but that's what we want. And there's no addition or subtraction, so we're kind of stuck here. So this is really as simple as it gets. So when you get it, as simple as you can get it, that's when you want to send it to your calculator. So I'll ask my calculator what in the world the logarithm of 5 is. And my result for this is 1.6094. So in this case, we cannot simplify further. Okay, pretty cool stuff. Natural logarithm, it's a fun time. Uh, simplifying them is very necessary when you do have more complicated expressions, but uh, it's not always the case. Sometimes you're already good. So here, the above solution is good. Is good. Awesome. 